for Super Science Saturday. Now this is an event that they put on every year out here at Missouri Western where they invite the kids from the community out and uh, put on some pretty cool fantastic shows showcasing how science is a, a, you know, not only a part of our everyday life but how it can be a whole lot of fun. Some of you guys are probably wondering what I'm doing here again. I mean, this is my alma mater. When they call and ask for my help, I always say yes. So this is California king snake, right here. So where's it from, you think? <laughs> yes, that's good. And he's black and white. This is good camouflage, because he lives in the mountainous regions, or gray, black, dark area. Um, all the snakes we got here are ours, and we've had them for a while. We bring them back and forth. We handle them. We get them in a little like this.
He's just walking around with a lizard hanging on him. Like, it's, it's no big deal. What? How old is it? Uh, you got a He's probably about 10, maybe. Nice. That's really cool. Yeah. There. You can put. This stuff here, you're supposed to, you know, you know what dry ice is? Ice is dry. It's ice that's dry. Yes, it is. Look at it. You can touch it if you want real quickly. You're never, ever supposed to touch it. Right? <laughs> <laughs> So we condensed all the molecules back down into something really, really tiny. If you look in there, you can even actually see some of them. I'm not going to hit it hard, I promise I'm not going to hit it hard, but sometimes it just needs a little nudge to go. See how hard I hit it? And do you see the depth that, that went? Inside. Mm -hmm. um, uh, while we finish the show, and it will continue to crush in. So, I'm a strong guy, but I'm not that strong that I can tap a steel drum and have it crush in. This is the weight of the atmosphere pressing down on that can. I'm gonna prepare the elephant toothpaste right here for you because we make it on site. I mean, we're a chemist, so we can do this, right? We always make stuff fresh and make it fresh. So if you think about the things that go into um, uh, toothpaste, right? You gotta have some kind of cleaner. So we use um, uh, some ivory uh, soap. Uh, we like this ivory soap, our elephant does, because it doesn't leave a bad aftertaste in his mouth. So I got a little bit of soap in there um, and uh, oh, whitening. Whitening. He likes his touch very light. Uh, sparkly white. And so um, if you look at toothpaste that's uh, whitening, um, it has uh, hydrogen peroxide in it. So I've got some hydrogen peroxide here. Now this isn't your run-of-the-mill hydrogen peroxide. This is really um, concentrated hydrogen peroxide, which is why I'm wearing gloves. Um, <clears throat> so I'm going to put some hydrogen peroxide in here. It be... And let me go ahead and mix it up a little bit so that uh, it's ready to go. Last thing that we need to do, um, yeah, just so that our elephant feels like he's really brushing his teeth with toothpaste, um, we've got to make it blue, because that's what color crest is, right? I have your blue toothpaste. It's very particular, our elephant is. So, all right. Now, the next thing that we need to do, my toothpaste is ready. All we need to do is get it out. We've got to squeeze it. Squeeze the tube, right? We've got to squeeze the tube and make it come out. So, that's the grip. No. Nope. All right, so being chemists, we're going to um, use a little bit of chemistry to help get that elephant toothpaste out of the tube. Okay. So <clears throat> I'm going to use something called potassium iodide. And potassium iodide is basically what we're going to use to squeeze our tube. Oh. And out comes our toothpaste. <laughs> Now, a couple things that you'll notice, right? There's steam, that's steam, it's hot. I, I can tell you it's hot, okay? we we'll get a lot of heat from this uh, particular chemical reaction that happens. It scares me. You should be, that's a, that's a pretty good sized bottle. Thank you. 
<laughs> That's our show for today. Well, thank you guys for coming out. <laughs> So I hope you guys had a good time coming along with me out here to Missouri Western State University for Super Science Saturday. I had a ton of fun. I even made a really cool little shrinky dink necklace for my logo. I mean, because why not? I, I think it turned out pretty good. Um, anyway, I hope you guys had fun and enjoyed it. If you're in this area near Missouri Western State University and you want to come to Super Science Saturday, it's something they do every year uh, towards the end of January or so, uh, definitely go check it out. I'll put a link in the description to their website and you can get all kinds of information there. All right, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you hit that like button down there. Don't forget to subscribe. And aside from that, I'll catch you guys next time.